I tried to break up with her. Yeah. And, hey, you know, things has been bad lately. Hey, we've been having a little distance yeah. in our relationship anyway. Like, right. I tried all that. Right. She kept showing up. It means that everything in life, you got your half and I got my half. Right. And we're going to put this shit together right. and try to make 100. Right. 50 50 in our household is, first of all, let's say I have 20 to 50 responsibilities. Right. And my wife have 20 to 50 responsibilities. You know what she does? Right. She pays 100% of that. Um, but one thing in particular that bothered me was in the same interview as him talking about why he goes 50-50 with his wife. He went on this whole spiel about how she's a stepmom to two of his kids and she's taking them in as her own. So I'm like, wait, 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 wait. So she's already taken on the job of raising two of your kids. Gabrielle Union says no to Dwayne Wade. She's ready to move on. He's humiliated her again. So we already know that Gabrielle Union and Dwayne Wade are for sure going through a rough patch. But here's the thing. Gabrielle is now taking things so seriously. She attended Bay's Renaissance movie premiere alone and during Thanksgiving, she made sure to throw in a whole lot of a sassy attitude proving she's over Dwayne and wants nothing to do with him and is never Never ending drama. Now, if you're not up to speed on this juicy gossip, let me fill you in. Gabrielle recently made a stunning appearance at Beyonce's Renaissance movie premiere. She's part of Beyonce's close friend circle, so it wasn't a surprise that she was in attendance on the big night. And of course, she looks stunning as always, however, she made it clear that she's not letting her relationship drama get in the way of her social life. She took to her Instagram account and posted a series of images and videos where she wrote her outfit, got high praise from her social media followers for her dress, but guess who was nowhere in sight? That's right, Dwayne Wade. I never find a man. Like maybe my standards are just too high, cause hell no. I'm not going 50-50 with a man, let alone a millionaire who makes, according to the internet, four times the amount of money I am. And it wasn't like she was like, yeah, we go 50-50 and everything's great. She was like, I stress about money constantly and I never feel secure in my career. This is quite the shocker because these two lovebirds are usually inseparable at public events. In fact, they're usually joined at the heap at this type of events. Remember when they both showed up at the Beyonce Renaissance concert with their kids? It was like a family affair. But this time, Gabrielle decided to go solo and it is safe to say that she's rocking her single like a buzz. I mean, let us be real here. If you are going to make a statement about your relationship status, what better place to do it than at a Beyonce event? It is like the ultimate power move. But seriously, it is pretty surprising that Dwayne wasn't with her this time around, which only means one thing. She's pretty much on bad terms with him. And interestingly, that hasn't been the only solo occasion for these two. Recently, they spent Thanksgiving together with Dwayne's family, friends, and their daughter, Kavia. But some gossip gurus like the media takeout noticed the pictures and videos from the holiday, and something was off. First off, Gabrielle Union did not post a single photo or video from the family holiday. Like nothing. And that's really odd because if you know Gabrielle then, I'm pretty sure you also know that she's known for posting about everything that happens in her life. The fact that she didn't post anything about it says there is definitely trouble in the Gabrielle and Dwayne paradise. And then, and then you want to be like, people are writing think pieces on the internet about my relationship and blah, blah, blah. But y'all keep doing these in-depth interviews and telling us these awful things <laughs> about your relationship in detail. Let me get this out the way. I'm not going 50-50 with no man. Not on a date. Not If you don't got the money, cool. We can go to McDonald's. We can do something you can afford. I want to feel provided for, period. But to make things even more interesting, Dwayne Wade posted about Thanksgiving in a series of IG live pictures and images. The images showed that Gabrielle was there, but she and Dwayne were not seen together in any of these photos or videos. Instead, the former NBA player showcased his father, friends, and other family members in various posts shared on his Instagram story. On his timeline, he posted a singular photo, a selfie, with a caption that stated, I have so much to be thankful for hashtag happy thanksgiving and as for gabrielle's part well she was seen hanging out with Dwayne's sister and of course their daughter kevia but that is pretty much everything isn't that weird 
Amen. The Thanksgiving dinner, which was held in Wayne's Los Angeles mansion, meant for family time, yet there is visible distance between them. You can't convince me otherwise that something is not wrong about their marriage. And to top it all off, Gabrielle has been posting uplifting posts about holding herself together on IG, which also suggests that she's having marital problems. We decided together, because I think I said one time when we was in Miami, I said something about it being my house that I paid for. Uh -oh. My wife looked at me, she was like, you will never say that to me again when it's something that we share. My wife was like, "That when we move to LA, I got half on it. You will never say my house again. At this point, I feel like Gabrielle has made it clear that she and Dwayne have indeed separated because even when she celebrated her 51st birthday in October, her husband was noticeably absent from her recap video that featured family and friends like Tia Mori. Because of all these odd circumstances, several critics have claimed to have pieced together details of an infidelity scandal leading to divorce have gained popularity in recent weeks. And who can blame them? A family is supposed to stick together, something that Gabrielle and Dwayne have not been exactly showing, even though they used to, especially Dwayne who even turned down the opportunity to partner with his supposed wife. To give you some context, Gabrielle actually took a big step as she launched her sustainable baby care brand called Proudly, but it turned out the former NBA star wasn't too keen on partnering with his wife. Then he's like, she's a millionaire actress. If she's stacking all her money and I'm spending all mine, she could just leave me with not What? First of all, you had a baby on her and she didn't leave. So she's not going anywhere. And second of all, if you're treating her right, why would you be worried about her leaving you just because she has her own money? Wade shamelessly revealed why he did not want to work with Gabrielle on their new brand saying, The need. It is all about the need. I did not want to work with my wife on this capacity. Listen, should be on me. Did you look at this email? Did you return this email? Do you know what I mean? We've got different processes. Of course, this is crazy because how does a husband not show support to his wife? Unless, of course, they aren't really husband and wife like they want us to believe. Anyway, as expected, many fans have also caught wind of the many divorce signs as one commented, NGL. His public outing with Xavier made think they might be on break. He doesn't take that boy to games like that and suddenly note the front row or having his son meet other athletes. That was his first time ever meeting LeBron, which is so odd because Wade and LeBron are so tight. And I knew they weren't together once he finally started going out to events with his break baby. Now, I'm dying to know what you think about this unexpected turn of events. Do you think that Gabrielle and Dwayne are really separated? Or is it just a temporary bump in the road? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. And hey, don't forget to stay tuned for our next video where we'll dive into most scandalous stories. Trust me, you won't want to miss it.